Hey everyone, it's Joe and Isaiah from the Automator. And lately, which is awesome, right? Don't get me wrong. I've been getting a lot of requests on how to help with, you know, as people sending the actual scripts, asking questions, you know, very specific questions in response, often not to the video itself, but just how to do stuff. And, you know, here's the thing is like, I do this, we do this for a living, right? We do this to get paid and, and I'd like to eat. No, I'm kidding. But um, we do have a couple links. Let me, let me make them visible. On every Friday at 10 Central Standard Time, just adjust it, which is 11 Eastern Time, if you're familiar with that, we have a live one hour, hour, hour and a half support session. And the top URL is the one I think you go there and you can post your question. You know, if you can't attend, you can post a question there. And every week I check those beforehand. And if there's a question in there, we'll try to answer it in that time period. But yeah. make sure you're very clear on your questions, right? Because often people write stuff and it, it's really hard to understand what they uh, sometimes sometimes I have to go ahead and try to figure out what he yeah. meant. I'll and tell you end, like, yeah. say is you're much better at it than I am because sometimes <laughs> I read the stuff and I'm like what, what, what is he my problem to do? is my brain goes like, How could I interpret this? And there's eight million ways, you know, yeah. and I'm like, Man, you know, I just don't know. The second one is if you want to get a reminder about the live call, you can go to the second one and then I'll just get your email address and send you a reminder that morning that, that, hey, we're having the call in about an hour. So that's all that's for. I don't use it for, I don't actually even add it to our newsletter. I, that's completely separate. I don't do anything with it uh, except for signing up for spam. No. I'm kidding. <laughs> and now the last one is, hey, you know, there, there are two types of consulting. One is, let's say you had a, a short question and it you just need direction on what you're doing, right? But you still, the thing is, which you understand when you're doing, when you post a question like in response to a YouTube video, it really helps having interaction with the person or having us look at a script, right? And that's yeah, where I'm like, I just don't. When you're when you're discussing with the person, you can actually clarify and we can ask right. you a little bit more questions and so on. So it is a little bit easier for us to just go ahead and like, okay, are you there? Let's talk about it. And it usually goes faster than me trying to understand what you wanted. Yeah, and it's much more likely we'll give you a good solution, right? Because yeah. My first step is always take a step back and really say, are we taking the right approach? You know, what's going mm -hmm. on here? Mm -hmm. But that's done very quickly, usually, right? And anyway, so, you know, that's, we give you charge and it depends on the project. So there's, there's a fee, you know, we'll keep it somewhat small. Like, let's say it's around 30 bucks an hour, roughly for, I just have a quick question, you know, and if it's less than an hour, you know, maybe we'll knock off some of the price. Now, if you have a, a larger project, you actually want us to fulfill for you. That's where we, we can, you can still use that same form, the consult thing, go in there and just say, you know, you're not trying to get live consulting questions answered right there. It's, hey, are we the right fit for you to help solve your problems for you, right? Can we take on okay. a project for you? Now, let me clarify something. Uh, so you guys can go to the live and watch us live and make questions for free in there. And we probably will be able to give you at least a pointer of as to what you can right. do or whatever, right? So 100%. that is for free, you know. Now, if you need a little bit more of a deeper question that requires us to kind of like investigate, you know, yeah. there, there was somebody that was asking about, you know, connections to the windsock, you know, like right. windsock connections to, because he wants to create a server on his computer that accepts some information. You know, I can answer that for you, but I, I would have to actually take a little bit more time for answering right. that. And most of the times I cannot take time from my work to go ahead and do that. You know, that, that, that that's where consultations come into place. If I need to do kind of, kind of like a one hour investigation on that, it is a little bit better if we do it in person, we talk a little bit better, you know, to have yeah, a little and, bit more information. And also to clarify, you know, I, I like helping people. I really do. It's fun, but people write me individually and I'm helping one person, you know, and yeah. when you write me with the script, how do I do this? And I'm responding to you, I'm not helping thousands of people i'm hopefully <laughs> helping one or maybe two right yeah. and that's why for me i'm like i just don't have the bandwidth to be always answering questions for free so if you want a one-off especially if it's something privileged you can't just share with everybody you can't do the live especially session. exactly especially if it is something that you're going to share yeah yeah but that that's why also is is like to me i'm like I, now, if I have an ongoing relationship with you, and I know you guys that are already working with me know, you can ask me a question, right? But it's the the people who I don't have ongoing relationships with, because we have a lot of clients now that we're doing stuff for, and I'm happy to help them quickly because we have a relationship where we're often helping each other is really what's going on. Check out these links if you do have questions, use them appropriately. Like I said, the first one, you could actually submit, you could even submit a script. Now, 
again, we have one hour and it, the meetings every Friday seem to get a little more and more people attending and asking questions. Yeah. So as to Zayas's point, if it's a simple question, we'll probably get to it. No problem. But if you have a very specific program in a very complex question, um, we can point to something like, well, you often might we want to look for, right. yeah, I could say like, you, you might want to look at this, this and that. And based on our right. experience, uh, you know, there are some people who have experience on certain type of libraries and others. So one of us might at least tell you, well, you might want to take a look at this at least. Yeah. yeah. And just remember also, if you go to my website and if you look up the HK resources, there's the, the auto hockey Reddit, there's Discord, there's an auto hockey forum, there's Stack Overflow. I mean, yeah. there's a wiki. There's a lot of free places where you can go and learn, right? So mm -hmm. that's the other thing is like, and, and there's a lot of people there that hang out and will help you. The thing is, the quality of their help, you know, maybe limited. Well, how do I say that right? It just depends on who's answering questions, right? Sometimes you get a genius <laughs> and sometimes you get someone that's new that's really trying to help, but they don't know, hey, I'm trying to automate Chrome when I'm sending keystrokes. And they're like, yeah, I can do that when you should be using, you know, a different approach entirely or doing yeah. API calls or, you know, there's so many other ways or using calm in Excel instead of sending keystrokes, which is one I, I see a lot. And it, <laughs> it's just like, you know, calm is so easy in Excel to be very fast. But anyway, right. that's the point. It's like, hey, we're we're professionals. This is what we do. This is also why we, you know we we charge. <laughs> Crazy. <Yeah. laughs> so thanks for watching. Hope hope there that clears go. up some stuff. I don't mean to be a jerk, right? I'm like I said, and and when I have time, I I still like to answer questions. When I see a question come in where it's not a very specific question and it, and it might help a lot of people, sometimes I will take time and actually make a video where, and that's where I make a video where I can share with everybody, right? Yeah. But more often than not, it's a very specific question that just doesn't help a lot of people. Yeah. Thanks, everyone.